What's up, boys and girls? This is White Gamer. Today, we're gonna be talking about the server release that EA dropped a couple days ago, which reduced the amount of XP that you earn in Rush. Now, this really matters if you're not level 100 yet and you're still grinding to get to level 100. And I know people have work, school, and some people just don't have enough time to play the game. This is gonna be important for you guys or just any of your friends that are still not level 100. So the other day, EA dropped a server release number two. That's what they're calling it. And in this little mini pitch note, whatever you want to call it, they slightly decrease XP from rush matches depending on match rating. As match ratings were previously given a higher amount than intended. Guys, this is huge. That means it is a little bit harder to level up now. If you're using rush rush was a really really good method to level up that was one of the tips that i gave in that video that we dropped about a month ago and how to level up quicker now if we compare it before and after the pitch this first clip that you guys see is before the pitch we finished with a 7.5 match rating right and for that they gave us 840 xp plus the attack xp plus the defense xp that gives us a total of 1000 112 xp right that's before the patch now after the patch i go i went on to play rush and then we add up our match rating xp which you get 900 which is already low before the patch the match rating alone if you had an 8.9 you would guaranteed at least a 1200 1300 off the back that's from the match rating alone now guys when you add our match rating xp and our attack xp and our defense xp add up to 1300 match xp and that's for 8.9 guys so right there you guys can already see a similar uh you already can see a difference before the patch and after we had a way higher match rating in this uh post patch match and we only got 1300 xp in total and that old clip before the the patch we had a seven point something match rating and in total we got 1100 so you can already start seeing the difference guys now rush it is harder to level up through rush if i were you guys i would recommend leveling up uh playing divisions or drop-ins i know not everyone has teammates to play divisions but i think dropping is the way to go unless you have good teammates in rush which if you've been playing rush you guys know that it is impossible to have good teammates in rush and guys another thing ea also added that they didn't really show in that server release too is after getting a 10.0 match rating in rush it wasn't possible to go below that once you hit 10.0 match rating this was talked about in the pitch note so that's basically saying that before the patch if you had a 10.0 match rating you would never go below that so again that's kind of unfair for the people that just got the game or still aren't level 100 because now when you do get a 10.0 match rating you can drop and eventually you'll get less xp if you drop below 10.0 but boys and girls i just wanted to bring out this quick video and talk about it and keep in mind guys you can also level up doing the skill games remember you get 4,000 weekly xp but boys and girls yeah ea has officially reduced the amount of xp that you were given um ever since like last week um which sucks because it's gonna make it harder for certain people to level up let me know your thoughts on this boys and girls do you like it do you not i think it kind of sucks because it's unfair for the people that are about to get the game or are still not level 100 and it's gonna make it just a bit more difficult now to reach that level compared to before the patch other than that guys don't forget to drop a like and subscribe and i'll catch you guys next time